Hey friends, it's Heather, and today I'm going to show you how to link a photo in your blogger post. I have a tutorial already on YouTube that goes over this, but it is showing you how to edit HTML. And in this video, I am going to show you how to just use the link button. All right, I am doing this video uh, actually right now for some of my Gecko Gals design team member friends. So there may be information here and you're thinking, why is she showing us this? And that is just because I am originally doing this video to help out my friends. But you'll be able to take what you learn in this video and apply it to your own blogs. Okay, so to my fellow Gecko Gals design team members, you're gonna to go to the email that Leanne sent you and you're gonna find the digital ephemera sheet that she has a link for. You're gonna go ahead and left click on that your sheet is going to show up. You're going to save it to your computer by right clicking and save as. Now of course mine got real big here so you'll see I've got a bazillion folders but I'm just going to click save and it says yes I know I've already got one. And then next I am going to um, go to my blogger dashboard and I'm going to use my test blog, which is Vintage Pink Roses. That's one I started out with a long time ago. But I would recommend you make a test blog. That way you can try things out on it and, um, you know, see if it works before you apply it to your real blog blog that everybody follows. So I'm going to go ahead and choose to create a new post. And I am in the compose mode. And I am going to add an image here. Choose file, and I am going to, uh, you know, unfortunately I can't make this smaller, but I'm just going to choose my photo that I know that I want. And it's going to upload, because I'm going to assume you guys all know how to do that. Otherwise, I have other uh, videos that will show you how to do that. I'm going to add the selected. And now here it is in my blogger post. I left click on that and I'm going to make mine extra large. And while it's blue and highlighted, like it is now, you can hit the link button. And now it's unhighlighted. So um, I'm going to show you. Look, I click over here to the left of the image. And then I click on the image, left clicking. And then I hit link. And now this little edit link shows up. You're going to go to your um, page here that you, you know, um, downloaded. You're going to highlight it, left click and copy. Actually, it's right click and copy. Go back to your post and you're going to right click and paste. And you're going to hit OK. And I always open things in a new window. That way people can still see your blog, but they can see what you linked to as well and hit OK. Now I'm going to go ahead and publish. And now I'm going to view. And I'm going to scroll down so you can see it. So this is live on my test blog. And so when I left click on this, it takes me to the image. So that way um, people will get the original size image which really I think they would still get it even if you do the other way, but it won't take as long for it to um, load on your blog. All right, now let's go back here for a moment. I'm going to go back and I'm going to show you, um, I'm going to do another post and I'm going to add the same photo. So just give me a moment here and I'll show you what could happen that might happen to you. I'm going to make this larger. And if you have left clicked to the right of your photo and then you hit it and you hit link, it just unhighlights it. And if you were to hit link again, then it's going to ask you for the URL. And so I would right click and paste it in there. And you'll see that if it shows up the same thing that you've pasted here, here as well, and you hit OK, then you're going to have a little link below the picture instead of the picture itself. So I'm going to go ahead and just remove this. 
and then I'm just going to highlight and get rid of it. So I'm going to go back to my picture. I'm going to left click on my photo. Let's close. Actually, I'm going to left click to the left of my photo, and then I'm just going to left click on my photo, go up here to the link, right click, paste, and you'll see that again this time it only shows up the URL in the um, where we want the link to go to. And again, hit OK, and then publish, and view, and again, if you click, it'll take you where you need to go. So hopefully that will help you. And um, if you have any more questions, just send me a message through YouTube, or you can send me an email to heatherahudson at gmail.com. Thanks, and I hope this helps. Bye.